Hi guys, I know I haven't done videos like this in a while, but I saw this one and I was like, oh my god. Oh my god. We are all cordially invited to the wedding of Nikocado Avocado and Orland Home because we're getting married, it says. They're getting married for like, what, the 15th time or something like that? But they're getting married, guys. Like, I've said this before. They're just like a really bad soap opera, except worse. You know, as though if, if you look at the soap operas, you know, you see your, uh, you know, One Life to Live, your General Hospital, uh, As the World Turns, Young and the Restless, stuff like that. You know, it's different shows, but the same basic, uh, you know, plot lines for all of them. You know, it's always the, you know, so-and-so are dating, but the guy, like, still loves his ex, and they're together. The other person finds out. Someone has a baby. Oh, I don't know whose baby it is. Somehow evil twins or, you know, evil siblings show up. and I mean, you know, even telenovelas. You know, the Spanish soap operas are kind of the same. They're just a bit more entertaining. Don't get me wrong. You know, I mean, the soap operas are lame, but telenovelas? Come on. Come on. I get those things are great. Um, but basically, they're just like soap operas. They just have the same plot line over and over and over, but without the entertainment part. Um, instead of, of, you know, bad acting and over the top um reactions and everything we just get mukbangs we just get mukbangs with just titles of we're getting married so and so cheated soon nikocado is gonna be like i'm having a baby and orland's not the father i'm going on to mori 500 dollar mukbang i don't know something and mori's like you are not the father and orland's like how is this possible? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe first off, because you're two dudes. It's just because it looks like you're pregnant doesn't mean you actually are, Nick. He's like, I think it's a boy. They're going to the doctor. Nick's lying on the, you know, on the table there. You know, the doctor's like doing it. And it's like, oh, my God, it has your eyes. Uh, no, that's a giant turd. It has your eyes. No, it's a giant turd. Oh, like he's gonna be beautiful, just like his is his father. Yes, when the turd comes out, it's going to be beautiful, just like his father. Um, but I think Orland's reaction pretty much sums up how we all feel about it. like, like. Like, like, you know, like, like, <laughs> like, like, you know, like, um, what are they eating anyway? Oh, they've got McDonald's. They've got their, uh, machines there. Actually, not the whole machine. CPAP machine. So they've got some Mickey D's. <laughs> um it's like steak he's got like a steak like a kebab kind of thing going on um oh that's one of those <clears throat> okay i've seen yeah it's like the hot dog and then there's like crushed up potato chips i think there's like um like a mango sauce or something on it with a poached egg uh the fries of French. Or here in America, we like to call them freedom fries. <laughs> um, yeah, you can see he's got a little kebab type thing. Skewer. Various sauces. Looks like we got some kind of lime. Like a pico de gallo kind of thing. I'm guessing those are all for the uh, hot dog. Me new Febreze Air Mist. How about we don't? 
That's what they're gonna need after all this food. Because you know Nick, you know, Nick's gonna be like Bleh. And Orland's just gonna be like Good thing we have all this Febreze in the house. Nick's gonna like crap himself and is like Good thing we have all the Febreze in this house. I poop my pants. I poop my pants. Remember those were the good old days when the worst he was doing was crap at himself. I mean, people say he's looking like he's getting a little, like, thinner, but... And let's go over to... I wasn't allowed to post this mukbang. What happened next will shock you. Uh... And it's just Orlin eating. I mean, he doesn't... He, he's so focused on the soup. Like, all that rice, it just kind of sits there. Just sits there. Drinks and drinks and eats the soup. Uh, Orlin. Yeah. I gained 13 pounds in one city after family size Taco Bell meal. The ending will shock you. It's like a Darman thing. Yeah, I haven't really watched a whole lot of it, like reviewed it. or well, not reviewed it, but. Eating like I'm on my hundred six hundred my six hundred pound life. Don't they don't you guys do that anyway? Nick screaming at me to eat his leftovers. Nick making me eat his leftovers again. Uh I know that Nick's I know what Nick's really doing with hungry fat chick. I just cheated on Nick and made him cry. Now I'm binging on pizza. I ate the entire family sized meal at Chinese takeout. What happened next will shock you on the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. Um, let's see about the rest of his channels. Okay, we're on more. More. Try three. He's back and he's worse than ever. Orlin hit me. <laughs> My mental. <laughs> my mental um he's back and worse than ever the ending will shock you so he's got uh chicken chicken wangs speaking of chicken i'm looking over there with, with a good mythical morning raising canes First Popeyes. I don't think I've ever had raising canes. Uh but I've had Popeyes uh plenty of times. Where is raising canes anyway? Like uh well I know this uh they're on the east coast, so uh I think they're what, New York? But I've never had raising canes. If you have raising canes in your state, let me know. And if you had it, how is how good is it? Because uh, I've never had it. At least I don't think. But Popeyes had a lot of Popeyes. Popeyes chicken. A deep South. <laughs> um. <clears throat> so let's see. Do they? How much do they eat? It's like how much do they eat of it? Yes. So they eat a good deal of it. Uh, Orlin hit me. All right, that was, let's see, let's see, a regular six days ago. Extreme talky, spicy, zombie noodles, mukbang, and recipe. The ending will shock you. No, that's what they should do. Like, all of them should be like a Darman video. What happens at the end will shock you. <laughs> they were they were mistaken. Um yeah, hungry fat chick. So wait, hungry fat chick, hungry hungry hungry, hungry fat chick, hungry, hungry fat chick. Yeah, see, I just I don't understand why this happens. Um, let's see. Shorts. It's been a while. It's been a while. Uh, I keep gaining weight. Now I don't care anymore. Am I fat? What I eat in a day to lose weight. 
Bruh. Uh, what is this? I don't know. It looks like your nasty ass feet. That's what it looks like. Am I unaliving myself for views? Well, Nick, you tell us. Everyone wants to know what your master plan is. Are you unaliving yourself for views? Because any normal person wouldn't have let themselves get to the point you got to. It's like he wanted a redemption arc, though. It's like, look at me. I'm like 400 pounds. But no, look at me. Oh, my God. I'm getting thin again. Happy days. I mean, why would anyone put themselves through that? All the, the, the health problems that you're, you're, you're getting from it. Because even after he loses the weight, he's still going to have some health problems. You know, there's just some things when you gain weight, there's just some things that don't go away. So. Ah, uh, Nick. The original form. This was like, it's like a Majin Buu situation. This is like the original Buu. And then he became like, Fat Buu. And like, he's, he's like, during the course of his YouTube career, he's been like different versions. You know, you'll have the regular, somewhat normal one, you know, the original. And then there's the one that like crapped his pants all the time and just had mental breakdowns. And then you have like the fat boo version and he's just eats all the time. And, but what we want is him to get back to the original boo. You know, or maybe it's a cell type thing. Maybe someone can just go over there, punch him really hard in the stomach, and he just spits out something, and he just reverts to his his former self, and then just do it again. Ugh, out comes eighteen, and then out comes seventeen, and suddenly he's, you know, he's he's himself again. Gohan, where are you at, man? We need you, son. We need you, Gohan. Just go over there. <laughs> And then he'd be like, What have you done to me? Um, on the next episode of Dragon Ball Z, Gohan punches Nick Akato in the Avocado in the stomach. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I really don't. Um, oh yeah, let's see if he's, uh, let's see, cameo. I haven't been on any of these in a long time. Great, whatever. Uh, no, I don't care. I don't care. Uh, five stars. <clears throat> and everyone, just 1%, 1%, 1%. Earth Day, other pep talk. You can do it. You can get thin, honey. You just believe in yourself. These are so amazing. Talk to you later. Not any. Thank you, Nick, so much. Oh my God, you're a super special, awesome, whatever that means. Uh, let's check out his Patreon. Um, let's see. I need your help. When was this? Oh, September. September. Yeah, he really doesn't seem to post on anything on Patreon. August 3rd, September 21st, September 22nd. We are now in March. March, uh, as of today, March 20th. So he hasn't posted in quite some time on Patreon. Um, oof, my freaking throat right now. I gotta stop choking on them dicks. No, um, no, I think it's from work. I've got these, um, big bags of, like, lint. And I push that crap into the baler, and it just, <laughs> right in my face. And little particles, I'm breathing little tiny particles, and my freaking throat hurts. You know, when I'm doing the, um, like, the tubes, sawdust, I'm, like, blowing my nose, and I get, like, mucus and, like, sawdust in it, and it's... I'm breathing in all and in all this crap at work. I'm surprised my lungs aren't just completely filled with like pieces of carpet and lint and uh, sawdust, but my my throat hurts. Um, 
I wasn't allowed to post this mukbang. 13 pounds in one sitting. Let's... How much... Well, after, he'd have to eat 13 pounds. You know, he'd have to eat 13 pounds of food. Which I really don't think that'd be 13 pounds of food right there. So, I mean, obviously it's Orlin, Snorlin, Borlin. And um, Orlin is a sweetheart. Well, he likes his sweets and is affecting his heart. Um, but yeah, Nick and, 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 uh, the, 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 the person in the height, uh, getting married, happy day. I ate everything I wanted on my cheat day. Your cheat day. Isn't that every day for you, Nick? I mean, and people, people have, for the longest time, ever since I started talking about Nick, like, hey, John, you should do a mukbang. Yeah, for the longest time, people ever, like, ever since I started reviewing Nick, it's like, whoa, you should do mukbangs. Well, first off, what kind of money do you think I have? You know, I'm already spending my own money on, like, the food reviews. No one watches them. So if, if I was to do mukbangs, the people wanting to see them should be the ones funding it. So, like, once a month, uh, to start with, you know, once a month we say, oh, hey, you know, you do this one. You know, like, oh, do Wendy's or Sonic or whatever. And then we decide how much it'll be. And then you guys can fund it because I'm tired of using my money and then not having anyone watch my videos. <laughs> I'm going out spending money on things for food reviews and then no one watches them. So, it's like, oh, sometimes you have to spend money. Yeah, I keep spending my money. And I only get like 30, 40 views. So if you guys want to see the mukbangs, support me on Patreon and donate, you know, help me on uh, with PayPal and all that because I've done my money type thing and it, you know, it doesn't work. Uh, so if you want to see mukbangs, you'll have to donate. Uh, I don't have a problem doing them because I work in a fact. I mean, I work every day. I'm working in a factory. I'm constantly on the move. So it's not like I'm going to end up like that. Uh, so, but yeah, starting out like once a month, we can say, oh, this month you can do, uh, <clears throat> you know, Wendy's. And then next month, we're like, oh, McDonald's. And then, you know, after that, be like Pizza Hut or something. You know, and then I see more and more people watching. And then more people watching means more and more money, you know, that I'm getting from YouTube. And then I can use the YouTube money. To get me this stuff but i'm working two jobs one job is enough to pay my rent and the other job basically doesn't really pay me much so you want to see mukbangs great start funding um but yeah <clears throat> oh my cheat day oh nick you're funny buddy boy i caught him cheating yeah he was like I, I I swear it wasn't what it looked like. Um, but yeah, mainly I just went with the, we're getting married because again, this is like what the 50th time, you know, it's like I said, it's like a bad soap opera without the acting or well, the terrible acting or worse, terrible, you know, worse acting and you know, the baby who they don't know who it belongs to and the con well I was gonna say without the constant cheating, but it is cheating. It's always oh Orlin cheated on me. Oh Nick cheated on me. That's why I'll just watch a telenovela. Seriously. Um But looking at some of the stuff, I wouldn't mind doing a mukbang of like, you know, like I love Pizza Hut. You know, I could easily probably eat about like three or so pizzas by myself. I feel like crap afterwards. I mean, I went to Pizza Hut the other day with my friend and uh, during the, the buffet at the time. I mean, and I had like three, four plates and each of them was pretty stacked with pizza. You know, I mean, yeah, walking around kind of like on the side, it hurt. 
but as soon as I sat down and, you know, just kind of relaxed for a few minutes, that pain went away. So, yeah, if that's something you guys want to see, like I said, I already spend my money on the food reviews and I don't get anything from it. So, if you guys want to see me do mukbangs, consider donating. And then once I get enough money on YouTube, then I can just start doing it for, you know, paying for myself. But, because I don't get paid jack on YouTube. So, anyways. That's going to do it for me. You guys know the drill. I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.